Hey guys, Rexasaur here, and welcome to Update Monday. Apparently it's a singing version um, on the 22nd of March 2021. Um, I just came off a team meeting, that's why I'm a bit chirpy. Uh, anyway, <laughs> how is everybody doing? Um, I'm doing much better this week than I was last week, that's for sure. Ho ho ho, last week was a week. Hmm. <laughs> Um, right, well, um, last week was a week, I think I'm going to just leave it at that, um, played a bit of Apex, um, played a lot of water tanks, and, uh, yeah, oh, watched quite a few cucumber streams as well, cucumber, um, yeah, it's just been a week, um, it's fucking awful is what it is uh what else is interesting to talk about really not fucking much if i'm honest um we watched king's speech yesterday with the crew it was really good um i thoroughly enjoyed it there were a lot and i mean a lot of scenes where jokes could be inserted it was very amusing we had a very laugh um so that was good fun we I had a chat with my brother, he's doing alright. We are slowly getting the ball rolling on potentially plans post lockdown and issues of COVID, which would be nice as a uh, as a crew. Um, and yeah, I've just been doing a lot of general things. Um, I just got another email from work, sorry. Um, <laughs> What was I going to... I was looking here because there was something I wanted to do, but I've forgotten. I've installed... Alright, okay. So I'm going to read The Hobbit later. It's going to be good. I'm going to go shopping. But because I don't need to go to the big shops, I'm going to go to my corner shop. Because my corn shop probably has the stuff that I need, but not the stuff that I don't need. Which is good. Because I need my stuff. Um, which sounded really threatening when I was like, oh, Give me my stuff! You got it. You got my stuff. Um, yeah, so that's going to happen. Um, I may have installed Total War Attila. I don't know why. I was just going through my... Basically, I installed a bunch of games. And I have this weird OCD thing where I want my Steam list on the side of my screen to be... Like, to have... No scroll bar, but also to fill the entire thing, which means I always need a very certain amount of games on that list. And um, I had gap for two, so I installed Far Cry 5 with the intention to play at some point, because I've got the game, I might as well play it at some point. Um, and I was like, scrolling through my games, I'm like, I don't know what the fuck I want to play, I don't know. What like, it's very likely I'm never going to play this game, I just installed it for the... Meh. But yeah, Total War Attila, just because Age of Charlemagne was a really good game, I really enjoyed Age of Charlemagne. I've forgotten what it was like. So I may play that for a bit, but hey ho. Um, what's probably going to happen is I'm going to play Three Kingdoms instead. Because I haven't played that in a while. Um, I think that's pretty much it in terms of like fun things that's happened. Hef hasn't put out a video this week, and I'm very upset about that. Um, Donkey, who doesn't even watch these, because he's an asshole still hasn't updated and uploaded the next episode of XCOM. Like, what's the point in watching a YouTuber if he never finishes this series? I finish all my series. <laughs> That's a lie. <laughs> there's, a, there's a very long set of playlists which says unfinished in my, uh, or abandoned in my series playlists. Um, a new update for CK3 came out, which I'm just like, I don't know what it is, but I just don't CK3 anymore. I don't CK anymore. Like, um, I really enjoyed CK2. I, as you probably know, thoroughly enjoyed CK2. And then I just stopped playing, and then I just stopped, stopped playing, and then got, like, CK3, played a bit of it, and was like, yeah, this is all right. Um, played something else instead. That's just the way it is. Um, been watching a bunch of streams. This week has been really weird in terms of streams, because a lot of streamers that I sort of half-watch... Um, like, I, I follow them because they're part of the Yogscast and stuff. 
just been gifted subs to all of these people. I'm just like, okay, I've just got lots of emotes, which I'm never going to... Well, I'm going to use the emotes, but I'm not really going to watch the streamers, because usually they stream when someone else, like, actually watches streaming, and it's just, like, confusing. Well, hey-ho, that's a thing that happens. Um... I had a conversation. I guess that's something I don't know. There was, there was more to that, but I thought it'd be really funny to just end it there. I had a conversation. It was alright. Um, no, I um, I had a conversation with, with my girlfriend regarding writing. Because this year I said I would write a book. It's March 22nd, I still haven't really started. <laughs> um, so we had a big discussion. I had a big not rant, but a, a big, well, what would I say, like a, um, oh god, what is it, a pitch, I had a pitch meeting with my girlfriend, where I pitched all these ideas for all the thing, like, all the books I could write, um, and she made a decision between two of them, and she said she preferred one over the other, so, um, I'll see what I do with that when I finally decide to start writing, what I'm going to do is I'm probably going to start on Easter weekend, um, which is, well, we'll start on the 1st of April, basically, and we'll go from there. Um, I still don't know whether or not it's bank holiday for me, if I'm working or not. I should probably check at some point with my manager whether or not I'm expected to come to work for this day, because regardless of whether or not I'm expected to go to work there, it doesn't matter if to me if I'm working or not because it's not like I can do anything right now considering the fact that we're still in lockdown um, and all my friends are stuck in their homes so hey -oh. today no tomorrow is Tuesday uh, fucking hopefully we'll be starting to play Baldur's Gate 3 it's been a while um, big update came we we're gonna start a session and then uh, one of the friends who was gonna play with us Bought it on Stadia and Stadia doesn't have crossplay with Stream. But he apparently found another service that allows him to play Baldur's Gate 3, so we'll see what happens. I bet you we're going to get on voice chat. It's like, yeah, I just bought a PC. I was like, fuck it. Just going to buy a PC, play on Steam. I'm like, okay. <laughs> so we'll see what happens there. I've um, been playing also, every Saturday, me and some of my friends have been playing Monster Prom. I don't know if you guys might know it or not, but it's really fun. Um... It's like a party game dating sim. Um, the writing is gold, gold tier, like comedy writing. It just makes fun of pop culture references and just all loads of stuff. Um, it throws curveballs at you like all the time. It just, it's so funny. It's so good. And we've been playing like one session every week. And last, on Saturday session, we accidentally got down an event chain that killed off one of the characters. And we're not entirely sure whether or not we permanently killed her off. Or whether or not she'll come back as if nothing's happened. But because at the end of the credits, which were very amusing. Because, well I say amusing. Normally the credits have, you know, you have a song playing. And you have funny like pictures of the characters and whatever. This one it was just no music and just the funeral. It was a funeral of all the characters in front of the casket of this character. So it was like, okay, <laughs> whoa. And then at the end it was like, you've unlocked chaos mode. I'm like, okay, what? Um, but we have no idea what that is. And we've told one another we're not Googling it. We're just going to play it and see what happens. Um, and I feel like that's a really fun way to play a game. What I really like is that we're doing it on sort of a weekly basis where we're not constantly playing it. So it's, I don't know, it's, it's interesting. It's like watching a weekly show. Um, where like a show, you know, an episode comes out every week, so you're excited for the next episode, um, without knowing what's going to happen next. And I really like that feeling of it. It's really, really nice. Um, so that's something that's happening, and it's really fun. What else? Um, my yeah. So as I said, I had a chat with my brother, and uh, he's he's been gifted and donated very kindly by his brother, his the the old PS4, so it remains in the family. Um, so he's been playing Ratchet and Clank because that came out um, for free um, Horizon Zero Dawn's coming for free in uh, mid-April so that's going to be fucking fantastic for him because it means he didn't have to buy the game um, and he 100 percented and got all the achievements on Ratchet and Clank which is something I haven't done and I'm very frustrated about this but he was like yeah one of the achievements the annoying one, and it's the one I'm missing is you have to use a disco ball on every enemy in the game um, and apparently he was he was just like I'm just going to throw a disco ball and run through the entire game 
So he didn't kill anyone. I mean, he does because at the end it explodes, but it's like, the fuck? And he was like, yeah, so I, I, I 100% of the entire game, and now I have no idea what the fuck I'm playing. <laughs> and I'm like, I know that feeling. I know that feeling very well. So meanwhile, I've got God of War installed on the PS5, which I haven't started yet. And I recently saw that the entire Ezio collection was on sale um, for like £11 or something on PS4. And I was like, those games are good. I'm going to buy those as well. So I've got that as well, um, even though I still want to play God of War first. So we're, I realised both of them are Ubisoft games. And I'm like, how about you a Ubisoft fanboy? And in the end, that's a big no. Um, I don't know why that line of thought went down there, but I thought you guys would like to know. So there we go. That's my life right now. So this week, back into D and D role playing, um, hobbits tonight. We're hobbit. Um, we're going to do uh, out of the frying pan and into the fire, and probably the next few chapters after that as well. Um, yeah, that's about it. So it's good. It's all good. Doing good. Hopefully, I continue feeling this energy and goodness all week because last week was shit. The week before was pretty shit. The week before that was even shitter. Um, it's just... This up and down is just awful. And I despise it. And there's not much I can do about it. So we I mean, there probably is, but I... Don't feel like there is. It doesn't really matter. I'm very grateful for the friends that I have, if I'm honest. For you guys watching this video, I'm very grateful that you are here to... Um, support me during my trying times. And the stupid things that I do. All right, that's it. Um, love you all. Have a good week. I'll probably talk to every single one of you at some point in the near future, and I shall see you all next week for Update Monday. Woohoo!